hello and welcome in this video i will talk about a very interesting process how to configure three way or two way matching tolerance percentage as per the vendor item vendor group or item group wise even it can be configured based on this con combinations as well as you the organization matching tolerance percentage is 5% as overall however that same organization wants to have a different organization different uh, you know tolerance percentage for different vendors or item or vendor group or item group or it can be even you know with the these combinations as well as an example what i have written down is for say suppose a organization matching tolerance percentage is 5% as overall but for certain vendors like say suppose for vendor abc the matching tolerance percentage will be 1% and for another vendor the tolerance percentage is 2% and then it can be the organization can decide for certain item the matching tolerance the three way matching or two way matching tolerance percentage will be 1% similarly they can have a business case for certain item group so like fg or any item group the matching tolerance percentage will be 3% similarly they can ask or they can have a policy where vendor or vendor group or item or item group this combination will have some tolerance percentage suppose for like four percent as an example how this can be configured in microsoft dynamics and system of finance and operation i will talk about in detail and i will show the configuration and the end to end demo as well let's see now i am in microsoft dynamics and system of finance and operations at first what i will showcase that the organization matching tolerance percentage from where i will go to accounts payable and i will go to setup and i will go to accounts payable parameters where i have configured the three way matching policy already where i will go to invoice validation and here if you see i have enabled this and i have said the invoice total matching is 5% as overall and then price and quantity matching is also 5%. So this is our organization policy. If we go ahead with this setup, then all the invoices will be matched based on this setup. Let's do a quick demo for this scenario. Now what I will do, I will create a purchase order and then I will show how this 5% works and then after that we will do some exceptions based on the vendor and item how the different matching policy works based on the vendor and item and item group that setup I will show so now what I am doing I am going with the 5% policy I will I will select any item and here maybe I can use 100 rupees I will confirm Confirmed. I will do the product receipt. Okay. Click OK. <coughs> and then what I will do? I will go ahead and generate the invoice or record the invoice. So. I will click on so suppose given the invoice number and then <coughs> what I will do I will calculate 5% of 100 is 105 five rupees right so what I will do I will give 105 in the unit price and if you see it is still passed and if I if I change it to sorry it is going down if I now change to 106 it will tell me it is failed because the organization policy is 5% tolerance till 105 or 95 I can add and system will accept as a past because that is under the tolerance percentage if it, however more than 5% it will not allow so this is a standard one right 
but our scenario is we need to configure based on the vendor or item so what I will do I will now go ahead and do the setup the first thing we need to do is we need to go uh, this invoice matching setup here under the setup and then we will click on price tolerance so from this price tolerance I can map I can do this configuration based on the vendor group item group item you know vendor or combinations as well it's basically the same we do with with match other things right charges group and all so here <coughs> I will show you the possibilities first so if you if we go ahead and then it gives us the possibility table table means it, to, it, it will allow us to select one item if we select group you can select the group item group but remember this is not the item group in the item master this is a group and we need to add this group to the item so similarly I will show you so I have created this group as a item price tolerance group and this item price tolerance group I have added into or I we need to add this item tolerance percentage group into the product management release product so it is not an item group it is a tolerance percentage group which we need to add in the release product <coughs> okay uh, maybe to show what I will do I will go to release products oh my god so uh, similarly okay before I show this in the item what I will do I will also talk about the group of vendor like I have mentioned this item group is not an item group it's basically the item price tolerance group Similarly, for vendor as well, it is not a vendor group. It is a supplier price tolerance group. Okay, so I will show this. Okay, uh, maybe I will delete this. And what I will do? I will first go to the vendor. And in the vendor, I will show where we will add this price tolerance group. So if you find tolerance so if you see under the invoice and delivery you can select this supplier price tolerance group which you have created so that means whatever the friend whatever the vendor will have this price tolerance group that will fall under that policy policy similarly we can go ahead and select this price tolerance group from the release products so go here in this 1101 so if you see this is the under purchase this is the item price tolerance group so here I, we can select that group which are which you have selected so this is how this uh, price tolerance group is set up this is one of the uh, example so what we will do I have already set up a policy which is for all the item but for only this vendor that price tolerance unit price tolerance is 1% and our organization policy tolerance percentage is 5% so what will happen for this vendor whatever the purchase order I create with any item the price tolerance will only be 1% let's see how it works so I will go to purchase order I will create new this is the vendor 61 and I will select warehouse click OK I hope you remember that the first one we have done with 195 and 105 was allowed now we will do the same thing 100 as a unit price we will confirm it's confirmed we will do the product receipt
is done now is time to check our configuration so what we will do we will see so now is it is time is time to check our configuration and the topic so here it is 100 so what i have told but i have configured one percent so if i give 105 like way we have given so it will shift failed because irrespective of the organization policy percentage we have added another level of tolerance percentage as per the vendor wise which is one percent so come organization policy won't work so what i will do i will select 101 and if you see it is passed and if i say 102 it will be failed even if my organization policy is five percent i have added a vendor wise policy which is one percent so if i said 101 it will change to pass if i say 99 if i it, it will still be passed but if i add 98 it will fail right so this is how the exceptions the vendor wise or item wise or the combination wise we can have the tolerance percentage so this is the unit price level percentage we also have another possibility which is invoice total tolerance here we don't have the item group and all here we have very straightforward which is vendor account wise say i will add the same vendor and here i will not give any percentage to zero percentage even if my organization policy is five percent i will have a extra control that for this vendor because of some reputation bad reputation i will have zero percent tolerance as an invoice total so now if we go to invoice the same purchase order right what i will do i will delete this pending vendor invoice and i will recreate another one to see this configuration in, in fresh so now what i am going to check is even if i have added unit price tolerance percent is one percent for this vendor but my total percent total tolerance percent of 3a matching policy is zero so what will happen as of now what we have been doing we have been telling the system or expecting that 101 will be a pass case right now if you see even if i add 101 it will be failed because if you see this product receipt quantity and price match is done but as a total invoice percent total invoice i have added zero percent tolerance as per this vendor so system will always do this match check vendor wise policy the total percentage and and if if as per the configuration if it is above or below tolerance it will always do the matching fail okay so that's how we can configure this business scenario you know what we have seen here that for vendor abc matching tolerance one percent for another vendor the matching tolerance percent is two percent for <coughs> sorry for item matching tolerance percent is one percent so these all combinations and config uh, or the business scenario or use case can be configured based on this under invoice matching setup under price tolerance here we can give unit price tolerance as per the vendor item group vendor group and with many combinations you can have multiple policy for multiple vendor or item and also if you want to have a control as per the vendor the total limit percentage you can also do that from this invoice total tolerance percentage so that's how it works in microsoft dynamics is it your finance and operations if you have this kind of requirement it can be mitigated and this video will be helpful for you to mitigate this requirement thank you as of now that's what i wanted to showcase thank you for watching stay tuned for another video like this bye for now